There is a small basin, or font, situated beneath the statue. Beside that, an orb-shaped button sits on a panel of stone. Should I push the button? Sure. This water smells like a strong acid, perhaps strong enough to dissolve metal or flesh, if Lindsay isn't careful. Okay, so if I needed to dissolve something, I could put it in there. I don't think I have anything like that, though. I don't think the gold bracelet goes in there, no. Oh, another panel. Also no fanfare. Wait. This is the way I came? Okay, I can do the finishing move. It stopped. Gold flecks of metal. Wrist and neck, so once again gonna need both parts. Got this one. Uh oh. Come on, you're targeting... You're targeting the chest. Just hit the chest. Oh my god. Lindsay. There you go. face. Okay, so this one... What was that? Are these on... Are these on timers? Oh, I think they are. Interesting. That didn't seem like very much time. Like, surely not enough for me to hit all the others, right? No, it's like... Five, ten seconds max. Huh. Anyway, so this one's green. So, um, what is it? Green is good against... Blue. Blue is good against red. Red is good against green. So, let's cast... Dispel as red. Shotgun time. 
I guess I will load it. Oh, it's red. I shouldn't be using green, should I? No, I should be using blue. Blue is good against red. So enchant item, cast it as blue. Cast a spell as blue. <laughs> Only problem is, I'm not going to fit in there, right? Because I'm not the size of a small dog. Job for my archaeologist's brush. Oh, this needs to be dissolved in the acid. Dirt encrusted necklace. I mean, if it's just dirt, surely you don't need acid for that, do you? Seems a little extreme. Whoops. I think I'm kind of running out of ammo for it. Yeah, that's all my shotgun ammo. So let's go back this way for the acid. Just gonna run like a true Indiana Jones. Wait, what was this? Just a face. What's this? Oh, haven't been in here. Oh, wait a minute. This is the very, very beginning. This is where I first entered. Yeah. All right. I think the acid was here, right? No. And I'm guessing it probably wouldn't be very happy about a dirt encrusted thing being put on it. Wait, no, that's not even the statue I put it on. Put it on a different statue. I, I've kind of completely lost my sense of where I'm going, so I'm just gonna run around and just keep going in a circle until I find where I want to go. Never mind, just found it. that statue? Aha! Remember me, Alex. How can I forget you, Grandpa? always meant the most to me ever since 
Ever since my parents died. Yes. Ever since they were killed. You've been my little girl. Yes. Jesus, that sounds so ominous. My little girl. Uh. This isn't really happening. So that was just a hallucination? Right? Oh, you know what? Well, wait. I was just thinking, maybe those enemies, those particular ones, maybe you can tell what their type is by the color of their eyes. Like, they shoot this green light out of their eyes. So maybe they're green. But then I also thought, well, wait. Doesn't that mean that they're lowering your sanity? And your sanity is green? So maybe it has nothing to do with their type. I don't know. It doesn't help that the color of sanity, mana, and health are all also elemental colors in the game, different alignments. But yeah, maybe they are, so in which case I should try... should try enchanting stuff with red for those enemies, perhaps. Let's try it. Enchant, assign, let's make it red. Replace what I currently have, there we go. Hi. Well, that one's definitely green. Shot of the shotgun to finish it off. I'm just thinking, you know what I'm I think what I'm leaving behind by going down here is whatever perhaps secret would have been revealed by hitting all those buttons fast. Well, no, then again, I'm definitely coming back to that area, because I still haven't traveled through that barrier I unlocked, right? Yeah, never mind. Yeah, so it makes like a sound effect when you hit them with the right elemental type. So they are definitely green, because red is working really well against them. very well hidden behind that cobweb slash dust. Has that revealed a new rune? Yes, it revealed this one. Creature. Hmm. What could I do with that? Creature... Creature what? Creature... Project? Creature Absorb? Creature Protect? That's apparently spell 12. 
creature? Protect. Maybe that gives me a shield. Try some other ones. Creature self? No. Creature... Absorb? One more. Creature... Whatever this one is. Okay, well let's try to cast that new one. Spell 12. There's no creature to cast the spell on. Oh, maybe this is for that small dog-sized hole or something. Like, maybe I can enchant a creature. This is a burning face, I just realized. The eroded mural appears to depict the arrival of a strange godlike entity before an ancient human tribe. Lindsay cannot recognize the god in the mural. He is mystified. really dark. doesn't catch on fire well. So I see green eyes, so these are red as well. Or red would be good against them, rather. I don't know, that doesn't seem like it took any less hits than it did before it was enchanted, to be honest. I'll just let them beat each other up there. <laughs> That's so sad to watch. Uh, hold on, do they gain their heads back or something? They do, they regrow their heads. Oh my god. That's neat. The updated mural depicts an ancient Khmer people coexisting with some kind of fertility god. I think I read this before, didn't I? When I was playing the other, like, earlier chapter that went here. The description seems pretty much the same. The mural is different, though. came from, right? Seems a lot lighter. Nice. Nope, definitely know where I came from.
Give me that rune. Come on. This one we've definitely seen. I've seen that mural before. Yeah, some trees have grown in here since. Summon Trapper. Ah, oh, that must be the creature thing I need to do, right? Maybe? So what does it need? No, totally separate from these two spells. Trappers possess a unique ability to transcend space and time and to relocate objects and creatures to their own plane. Oh, right, the trappers, the little cute things. I can summon my own? Tear and Aratek runes. Tear and Aratek. Tear and Ar. There's Aratek. So which one's Tear? It must be one of the unknown ones. Probably the one I just got. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so if I just summoned my own, what's it gonna do for me? Aside from being obviously what I need to probably get through that little thingy that I unlocked, the little space, but aside from that, like if I just cast it right now. Hey, buddy! After a trapper has been summoned, press A to trap an enemy when it is targeted. Uh, press... something. What is that button? Press and then just like a circle with no indication what it is. Press something to release control of the trapper. They cannot open doors nor pick up items. Hmm. Okay. Ah, yeah, so I'm in control of it right now. Can I move really, really slowly? I can move really slowly, it's a little tiny trapper. Oh, Come on, let's see how slow we can go. Yeah. My stealthy little trapper boy. Anyway, so we target them, we press A. Pew! Oh, right, it dies when I do that. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, we're here. Oh, I can't. No, no, no. Don't let him. Don't let him get me. Oh, help me. How you doing there, buddy? You got half sanity. You're half sane. It's good enough. Easily controlled. What makes you think I want to control it? <laughs> Arrogant man. Kill him. Make sure you succeed this time. So Mantrock is purple, neutral. The darkness shall. All right, we never got that door open before. Is that who I think it is? It is. Do not touch the heart, flesh, and bone, lest you become like me, a dead, rotted husk. I have waited many centuries for you. It was not easy hiding from the Dark Ones as they searched for me. At first they passed by, not thinking that the heart was inside my dead body. But I was forced to find refuge here. You must seal the heart so it never contacts your flesh and take it to the gathering of light. Take the heart there, or the world shall fall under a reign of eternal darkness. The veil of reality can only be pulled back so far, mortal. Take your stand and fight the darkness. in the library. Behind a very silly book that stands out from everything else. Interesting. So, I didn't go through the rubble, and I also didn't do anything with those buttons you press that are timed. That's the first time in this game that I've seen something that is apparently a secret that is totally optional to do. Up until this point, everything that I've seen so far seems necessary. Like, I don't, I've never noticed anything in a chapter that seemed like an optional secret, as far as I can remember. So I wasn't expecting it. Like, I wasn't expecting to have to go back to do it. But I guess once you learn the Trapper spell, you have to go back and... You have to go back pretty far, actually, to get to that spot. It's interesting. It's gonna have to change how I think. If it seems like I can do something, then I gotta think that maybe I need to go back to do it rather than going forwards and hoping that it loops back to it. So I must have missed quite a few things. I wonder what. Hmm. Anyway, I think that's a pretty good place to end. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.